Brent Sutter pied him in the ear because he missed the face. He hadn't scored for a while. Now came out with the pie stuck to his side of his head saying, now we see why this guy hasn't scored in 20 some games. He can't even hit him in the face with the pie. Each time Al's birthday rolled around, whoever that was the youngest guy on the squad or hadn't done it yet had to uh, hit Al. It was usually just a big, big tray of shaving cream. It always falls on a rookie, unfortunately, and you know we rev him up good. Like, oh, you know, Al, he loves it. You know, he really enjoys us as part of, you know, our Islander heritage here. We got to get Al, and he's he's awesome about it. And afterwards, like, oh my God, I don't know where you're gonna go, it's Siberia, someplace. He had a good good character, good humor. And you know he loved us as we as we all know, uh, but he was all business most all the time. Even the pie in the face, only a little bit of a laughter. Ah, it's good on this. I did bust his glasses and I felt horrible about it afterwards. But he skated us hard that day. He took it like a champ. Thank goodness. I thought I was going to the minors because uh, you don't know what's going to happen when you break your coach, coach's glasses after you pie him in the face on his birthday. That was a great part about Al. He was, you know, he was a former player, so that all that stuff went on when he was playing. So to have it happen to him, he just felt like one of the, one of the players.